Now, Ji Chun's 1928 work "Courtyard with Banana Trees" depicts the area where he lived in Tainan and the leisurely scene at the garden there. His wife is portrayed on the left behind the banana tree. The interesting aspect of this painting is the huge banana and its big leaves. The sunlight shines down from the banana tree leaves onto the yellow earth, bringing a change of light and shadow to the scene. If this is a contrast, we can see that the colors would change. And the shapes and images are dynamic as well. This is related to his later artistic development. Let's look at a 1931 painting that was displayed at the Imperial Art Exhibition. Though it was restored, we still need to use our imagination to see the original image. We can see that the scene is farther away. The coconut tree is actually the one in front of the Kaohsiung train station. It's in front of the Gaosheng Station, facing So San. If you don't go back to that era, you will definitely get this location wrong, because it's not the location of the current station. It's actually the old train station of the Sizhuan Metro. There is a very pretty and modern architecture, a water fountain, and three very tall coconut trees. These artists joined the Imperial Art Exhibitions in the late 1920s. They had to use representative scenes and images from Taiwan, especially natural images like plants, coconut trees, and bananas. This type of scenery is highlighted. There is a large painting showing the sunshine on the yellow land. This is Jiayi Street scene by his classmate Chen Chenpo. You can see that intent in outside Jiayi Street as well. Let's look at his later works, like Forest at Night. He went to the West in 1962 and was inspired by Impressionist art. In his work Forest at Night, one can see the complementary use of colors and shapes. They're like a symphony, and the colors are like notes that form a magnificent symphony. Let's look at his 1975 work, Landscape in Spain, that was done a year before he passed away. Though it looks like a very flat painting, where you can't see its depth, the structure is half impressionist. The colors are very colorful, bright, and vivid. It's a work that makes people look happy. This type of painting style is related to his free and casual state of mind in his later years. He felt that all forms, whether figurative or abstract, are not that important. Any form is to express the spirit and strength of the artist. So from the work Landscape in Spain, we can see that he uses any form of free fingering smearing fingers or line hooks, or even uses the back of a paintbrush to make lines. This is very free and inspirational. The whole image has been constructed into a harmonious work. This is an important later work.